Hi there, Roger Brooks here, and today we're gonna to talk about setting yourself apart from everyone else. If you see all these gumballs here, we went to the United States Census Bureau and we put a gumball per their incorporated places directory for every city and every state in the United States. And by the way, there are just under 20,000 cities and towns in this country. Plus, over here, you can see that there are hundreds, if not thousands, of other villages, towns, scenic byways, there's state parks, national parks, and other places that also want a piece of tourism or economic development. Here's the big question. If you happen to be promoting Madras, Oregon, you know what, or I happen to be looking for Madras, Oregon, what sets you apart from the other 241 cities and towns in Oregon? Because when people use the internet, they're not necessarily typing in Madras. They may be typing in rock climbing in Central Oregon, best Italian restaurant in Portland, uh, job opportunities in Southern Oregon, um, best river rafting in Oregon, um, or they may be typing in a best summer destination in the Northwest. The point is they're not typing in cities and towns at all. They're typing in what they're looking for in an approximate location secondly. So the point is, out of these 242 cities and towns, what sets you apart from the other 241? When you type in city or town, chamber of commerce, or just city of Madras, you say, woohoo, we're number one on the list. You're the only one doing it. Everyone else is looking for a business opportunity, or a place to vacation, or a place to raise a family or retire. And that is the power of finding your focus. So what you need to do is find your niche in your marketplace, you don't have to be you don't have to be different than all 50 states, but you do need to be different than those in your market area. Find your niche and promote it like crazy, and that will bring you new residents, new businesses, new investment, and tourism.